excessive alcohol use can lead to the development of chronic diseases and other serious problems including high blood pressure, heart diseases, stroke, liver disease and digestive problems. Cancer of the breast, mouth, throat, esophagus, voice box, liver, colon and rectum. However, the mild drinking habits are unknown. Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I'm Mr. Zaman and today I'm going to discuss about the effects of cognition in mild drinking. Consumption of seven or more units of alcohol per week is associated with higher iron levels in the brain according to a study of almost 21,000 people publishing July 14th in the open access journal PLOS Medicine. Iron accumulation in the brain has been linked with Alzheimer's and Parkinson's diseases and is a potential mechanism for alcohol-related cognitive decline. Total of 20,965 participants from the UK Biobank reported their own alcohol consumption and their brains were scanned using magnetic resonance imaging that is MRI. Almost 7,000 had their livers imaged using MRI to assess levels of systemic iron. All individuals completed a series of simple tests to assess cognitive and motor function. Although 2.7% classed themselves as non-drinkers, average intake was around 18 units per week, which translates to about 7.5 cans of beer or 6 large glasses of wine. The team found that alcohol consumption above 7 units per week was associated with markers of higher iron in the basal ganglia, a group of brain regions associated with control of motor movements, procedural learning, eye movement, cognition, emotion and more. Iron accumulation in some brain regions was associated with worse cognitive function. This is the largest study to date of moderate alcohol consumption and iron accumulation. Although drinking was self-reported and could be underestimated, this was considered the only feasible method to establish such a large cohort's intake. The limitation of the work is that MRI-derived measures are indirect representations of brain iron and could conflate other brain changes observed with alcohol consumption with changes in iron levels. Given the prevalence of moderate drinking, even small associations can have substantial impact across whole populations and there could be benefits and interventions to reduce consumption in the general population, the researchers concluded. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.